right, this is a review of the Fluke Network coax toner. And this is, uh, I think, the one that can do uh, a little bit of uh, Cat5 networking. Uh, when you get it, you'll have instruction manuals in here. And then uh, you also have, it's like a pigtail with a coax on it. And the pigtail has two alligator clamps, so you can connect like a, a telephone toner to it. But uh, you get, what you get in it is you get, you know, some adapters. You know, you don't really use any of these. And then you get some uh, barrels, coax barrels, to connect two coaxes together. But, uh, you know, these I added myself. So, you, uh, if you want more uh, barrels, you can add them yourself. And obviously, I'm missing some numbers. It goes one through eight up here. And, you know, it's real easy to lose some. So, if you do get this, you know, make sure you got your toners <laughs> before you leave. If you're, you know, using it for work. But uh, this is the main part right here. It's got a screen for the number. You just plug in your coax right there. So if you get a straight piece of coax like this, you know, obviously you're going to need the barrel so you can get this over it. And now on the other end, you know, let's say it's in another room or, you know, wherever it is in the house, you connect the idea, you know, the part either on the wall plate or the coax sticking up through the floor. I mean, the only bad thing about it is, <clears throat> is, is uh, outside, you have to put a connector on each coax until you find yours, because this won't do it without a uh, connector on there. But the way you use it is, you take it, sorry, you just turn it on by pressing that, it'll blink at you. Let's see if I can do it one-handed, sorry. Holding the camera and doing it at the same time. You stick it on there. And then it tells you eight. Which, and then on the other end, boom, eight lit up. And then you just press and hold the turn off. Well, sometimes it gives you a false reading too, so. <laughs> like if you use the five, um, if there's a short on the coax, it'll show up as like an S on here, but it looks almost exactly like the five. So if you get this kit, uh, don't use the five because if there's power on the coax or if there's a short it's not look like it's coming up five And then you'll come inside and wonder why your TV doesn't work So five is kind of useless unless you pay a lot of attention, but the, all the rest of them work pretty well And then this is another adapter. I think this is for phone. Yeah careful you don't do that It's for phone. It's to tell you if you got voltage on the phone line or not for like home phone, I don't really use that. Mainly, you just use these. And uh, other than that, like I said, you got this. Uh, the battery is in the bottom here. You just unscrew this, and it's a uh, AAA. And the battery lasts pretty long. But uh, I mean, it's kind of expensive, but it works well. I mean, uh, like that stupid false reading I told you about. I mean, really, the only false reading you get is about the. Is, uh, is with the five. But I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, you know, if you're doing coax work, this is definitely something to invest in. There's a good